Hey there, and welcome to Dynatrace. I wanted to give you a really quick demonstration as to how amazing Dynatrace is and how we can help you with your enterprise cloud monitoring. It's very, very simple. To deploy Dynatrace, it's simply a matter of installing an agent on a host. We have one agent, automatically installs on the host, and it automatically detects everything in your environment. So to get started, you select your host that you're running, whether it's Windows, Linux, Solaris, or anything else, deploy that agent with a single line of code and we automatically detect everything in your environment. This is what we call the smart skate. There is zero configuration required in order to set something up like this. Once we deploy on the host, you can see in this particular instance, we have 47 hosts that are instrumented. We automatically see then everything. We call this the full stack from the processes, the services, all the way up to the applications. We see all the interconnections between the hosts and the applications and all the processes that are running. So in any instance, I can pull up any one of the hosts and see exactly what's running. And we see all the way down into the infrastructure layer as well. So everything that's running in your cloud environment, all the way down to a CPU. So let's take a look at our problem analysis screen. As you can see, we've got numerous problems that are occurring, unfortunately, but thankfully Dynatrace has been able to surface up what I should pay attention to. This particular instance takes my interest. I can see that we analyzed 230 million dependencies in order to detect a root cause. The root cause here is a response time deg degradation. I can also see that's related and has impacted the CPU saturation. That typically would probably send two different teams off to try and resolve the problem. I can also see here that 114 users have been impacted. What I can do is, because this problem occurred at 157 to 2.51 a.m., hopefully everyone is asleep at that given point in time, and it only lasts for 54 minutes, because we missed that problem, I can replay it. I can go back in time and look at the problem evolution and see what happened, why did it happen, where did the problem occur, what do I need to do in order to fix it. So I'm able to replay the problem evolution. As you see the problems occurring, you can see all the different alerts that are coming through. Those typically would trigger another alert email that would be sent to you. What we're able to do with our problem resolution is to put the entire problem into context. Because we're capturing every user session, we can see every user ID, when someone complains about their user experience, you're simply able to go in, pull up the user tag, and we can search for a name. Let's say this particular person's name was Tammy. Let's pull up Tammy's user experience. I can see that Tammy has interestingly come from Australia and she's had many sessions on our site in numerous weeks. I can see that she accessed both our mobile site and our website but what was particularly interesting to me was she complained about a particular session that occurred. I can then pull that session up, I see all the experience that she's had, what browser she's come in at, the, the ISP that she's using, her IP address, the location, the operating system, but I interestingly can go down and see absolutely everything that has happened. I can see every click, every tap, every swipe. If she did say at any particular point in time that there was an issue with one particular part of her journey, like she couldn't log in, I'm able to pull that login session up, have a look at that experience, and even perform a full waterfall analysis on just that click alone. So what Dynatrace is able to provide to you is not just a full stack approach, it's an all-in-one platform. It reduces the need for you to have many different siloed analytics tools so that you really have one source of truth to see everything that is going on in your application environment and how it impacts your end users. Dynatrace uniquely works with people like AWS, with Red Hat, with Pivotal, with Google, with Microsoft Azure to automatically pull in many of the different metrics into this single dashboard. So you have that single view across a hybrid multi-cloud enterprise environment. So whilst I've only gone through this in a very short amount of time, I really haven't gone into all the levels of detail that is possible. But do we really need to? If you have this single source of truth with an artificial intelligence telling you what you should focus on, it allows you to focus more on innovation and less time focused on troubleshooting. I encourage you to take a Dynatrace trial, deploy the agent and see for yourself 
how remarkable Dynatrace is and how it's unlike any other monitoring you've ever used before.